Ladies, if you're suffering from PCOS, these 10 lab markers must, must, must be done. And if you have not had these labs done, you need to find a provider that will. So you can reach out to me. Starting from number one, in no particular order, is number one is your total white blood cell count. The sweet spot, when I say the sweet spot, I'm talking where normal healthy women live that don't have PCOS. is right around between five and six. Yours could be lower, yours could be higher. Number two, homocysteine. This is an inflammatory marker. The sweet spot is between five and six. Number three, is is your vitamin D level. Vitamin D should be around 80. Number four should be RBC magnesium. I'd like to see that greater than six. Number five is fasting insulin. The sweet spot's around five to six. Number six is your hemoglobin A1C, a 90 day marker for sugar. I like that around five to 5.3. Number seven should be your testosterone and you wanna check that on day five and day 15. You need to do two spot checks during the month. Number eight is your total estrogens. Number nine is your progesterone again on day five and on day 15. And then finally, number 10 is a complete thyroid panel, which includes TSH, total T4, free T4, total T3, free T3, reverse T3, and any antibodies that may be against your thyroid. If you've not had these labs done, reach out to me and you can get help. You don't need to suffer with PCOS. If you enjoyed this content, please like, comment, and share this with a loved one.